Nine threats against Muslims planning to attend Friday's Muslim Day at the state capitol. Right now, increased security is planned and leaders with CARE, Oklahoma, say they're worried about participants' safety. Fox 25's Kylan Mills explains why. Kylan. Mike and Wendy, a lot of just hateful messages being thrown at CARE Oklahoma right now because of their second annual Muslim Day at the Capitol. Organizers say the event is a chance for members of the Muslim community to talk openly with lawmakers about issues that are important to them and to figure out ways to make Oklahoma a better place. But after dozens of protesters showed up to the event last year and they've received several online threats over the last week, they say safety is a big concern. Organizers say it's supposed to be a special day for Muslims to take part in their local government, but instead they're fighting hate speech and threats. We've, we've heard all kinds of crazy things, you know, from people saying they want to throw bacon um, at attendees or block entrance to the Capitol. Adam Sultan. CARE OKLAHOMA HAS SPENT HOURS PLANNING THE SECOND ANNUAL MUSLIM DAY AT THE CAPITOL COMING UP ON FRIDAY. HE'S EXPECTING AROUND 250 MUSLIMS FROM ACROSS THE STATE TO COME OUT FOR PANELS AND DISCUSSIONS WITH STATE LEADERS. Um, THIS IS AN OPPORTUNITY FOR MUSLIMS TO ENGAGE WITH THEIR ELECTED LEADERS AND TO SHOW THE TRUE FACE OF THE MUSLIM COMMUNITY AND, and TO REALLY uh, BALANCE OUT uh, THE NEGATIVE MESSAGE THAT SOME PEOPLE TRY TO PUT OUT THERE. But leading up to Friday's event, Sultani says the organization has received hateful messages online like this one. Everyone should simply put as big a pocket full of bacon bits in their pockets and throw it like wedding confetti all over those Neanderthal blanks. The saddest thing about all of it is that, you know, being at the Capitol and engaging with our elected leaders is one of our fundamental rights as American citizens and something that each and every American, regardless of their faith or background, should value. And Sultani says they know of six groups who plan to protest on Friday, so they've planned increased security. He says it's just a part of the constant struggle for the Muslim community to fight stereotypes in today's world. But we are part of the fabric of our beautiful state and our country, and I want our fellow Oklahomans to know that our religion is one of peace, of love, of mercy, and of compassion. The second annual Muslim Day at the Capitol will take place on Friday from 9 to 3, and anyone is welcome. Kylan Mills, Fox 25.